Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I wanted to film today because we have some exciting things going on. We're getting a brand new sectional delivered for the living room. So I'm gonna be cleaning up a little bit this morning and getting that delivery in about an hour or two. So I'll show you guys that and um, I'll show you me putting it together and everything and give a little mini review on that. Yeah, it'll just be a good productive day and I'm excited to show you guys the sectional really really excited about that so yeah we will go ahead and go downstairs and get some caffeine okay i just put on the tiniest bit of makeup because i just watched myself in that last clip and i'm like you look pale girl so a little bit of makeup on took me five minutes now we're gonna go get some caffeine i look so weird in the living room right now we put the red couch in the garage we're gonna try to sell it um so we'll see how that goes but yeah, so the sectional is basically going to go right here, and it's it's really big. I measured it last night, and I'm like, oh my gosh, it's going to be huge, but it's going to be so nice and cozy in here. We have so much room in this living room. Um, originally, behind this mirror, um, there's like a box for like an old TV to go up there, but new TVs are too big to fit up there, so um, my dad and I actually built that mirror. Um so yeah, the mirror is up there and TV is now on this wall. So yeah, this love seat is not gonna stay in here. Um, I'm probably gonna put it upstairs in my office. And then we have two matching chairs, the Wayfair chairs. Um, I think that one will stay over there in the corner with the um, fake olive tree. And then I'm not sure about that one. It might be going in another room just because the sectional seats like six people. Um, so yeah, but I'm so excited to see how it turns out. I watched a YouTube video last night of, um, a lady and her husband putting the couch together and it was super easy. Um, the same couch we got. So very excited about that. Do you want to go outside? And a grass update, even though nobody cares. The grass is growing back. Slowly, but surely. I think I'm feeling an energy drink this morning. We found some blue slush at Target um, when we went to the beach last weekend. And we bought like all of them. We literally bought all of them in the store, which is at least like 10 or 12. And we now have two left. I love this flavor. But also, I feel like it tastes exactly like cherry slush somehow. I'm not really sure, but it's delicious. I haven't been into coffee as much lately. So this has been good. Or some mornings I haven't even been having any caffeine, um, which is probably a good change. But yeah, I'm going to make my water. And then I need to like vacuum the living room and the rug in there just so... We have like a fresh start when the sectional gets here. And I really just gotta keep an eye out outside for when it's gonna be here. I'm gonna have to like put the dogs over in the gym room to lock them up in there. While the sectional people are here, I think how they do it is they bring it in and just like sit everything down and I'll just unpack the boxes, which is fine. Um, I hope. <coughs> Duty calls. Where are we parking? He thinks there's like a creature that lives under our deck, which it probably is. sectional just got dropped off they even offered to put it together for me but I was like I don't know exactly where I want it and I think it'll be easy to put together so I'm about to do that now um, but this is what it looks like um, it's six different pieces I think there's another one right here 
but like this is what it looks like up close it's really soft um yeah i'm just so excited we've never had a sectional before and i think this is, goes really really well with the chairs that we have too and just kind of the overall like very neutral feel in here the dogs are very upset because they had to go um in the in the gym for a few minutes while the guys were here delivering but um, the guys that dropped it off were super nice, and like I said, they even were going to put it together for me, but I kind of wanted to do it myself so I can move some of this other stuff around, and the dogs were, you know, barking up a storm, so I wanted to be able to let them out. So, yeah, we will see. Hopefully, this is easy to put together, and I'm so excited, so let's do it. pouch underneath and they were in a box and then I've just taken them out of the box um and it'll be like that for all the other pieces too this is the only assembly you have to do with this couch um besides just locking the pieces together how you want it to go so it's super easy also these pieces are super lightweight they're full they're like big and bulky so they're hard to carry I'm sure on your own like they were using like a cart to bring them in but so there's like little pieces under here this is the male section of the attachment mechanism lift the male section in order to unattach the pieces okay and this is something else over here section of the attachments cannot lift it and separate into sections. Okay, so I guess this on the other one fits into that. Okay. Oh, this feels so nice. What do you think? He's like, uh, put me on the old couch, please. What do you think? Your brother's terrified. Hi. Hello. I know. Okay, we gotta put the rest of it together, okay? Okay, we gotta put it together. to put the feet on the last piece and this is what we have so far it's a hot mess in here this is gonna be a very big sectional but I'm really excited to see how it looks so yeah let's finish this last chair and then hopefully I can figure out how these things hook together little strings on it but it's just like for this bottom part so I've just been kind of cutting it off not a ton and I don't think it really matters because this is not seen but just figured I'd mention it okay gosh this is so big <laughs> also not sure how the rug is gonna go in here like I don't know if the rug needs to be turned a different way. I guess we'll just have to see, but like I said, these pieces are not super heavy. They're pretty easy to move around, so I don't think it'll be too big of a deal. There's a ton of different ways to put the uh, sectional together, 
So that was one of my favorite things about it. You can make it like one big piece all together, like a bed if you're having like a movie night or something. Um, and then you can do it all kinds of ways. You can do it with a couch and a love seat. So very versatile. So even if it's huge in here, there will be some way that we can make it work. And it's so like plush and comfy and I'm just so excited about it. I'm trying to think of the, like how this is supposed to go together. So I really don't know. I think I'm gonna have to look at a picture. I wonder, you know what? There's like a different instruction book. So there's like three of just the regular chair part, two corner pieces, and the ottoman. Okay. That kind of makes it easier to put together. So it's basically saying that I need to put them all like on their back and connect them that way. Oh boy. This is going to be a pain. I should have just let the guys do it, but <laughs> I just wanted the dogs to stop barking. Well, I guess I'm going to take off all the tags now. Okay, so I just watched a video and I think I was making it more complicated than it really is. And the instructions are, mm. so I don't have to flip them all over. There's a little prong underneath. Um, I'll try to show you. It's like right here, that little black thing poking out. Um, and you basically just, oh, here, you just turn it, and then on the other pieces, this is called the female piece, and then there's the male pieces, and they just fit in there. So, let's do this. Picture diorama back up. Okay. So, I want that there, and then I want a corner with it. So, this is the male piece. It just looks like nothing, I think. Right, Pop? Okay. So. <laughs> this is crazy. Watch me like break something in the process. Okay. So. Are we lined up? I don't know if we are. I don't know how this works. It's in there. It sounds like it's in there. <gasps> wow. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. Like, also ordered um, some nice uh, throw pillows for the couch. So I think I got two 18 by 18 and two 20 by 20, like the down uh, pillows. And then I ordered some really cute, like, kind of natural but with a pop of blue pillowcases um and I got all those from Amazon and they're gonna be coming today and I think I want to get like a dark blue um like woven throw blanket for down here as well um and I just kind of want like a dusty blue but still very natural looking blue to be the pop of color in here because I have like a couple of rugs over here in the hallway that are um, still earthy, but blue is like kind of the accent there. And I just kind of like having a little pop of color in here. Um, so we have mostly neutrals and then of course plants everywhere and a little bit of blue. So yeah, I'm so glad. Oh, okay, I'm gonna put the rest of this together and then hopefully it's not too big for the room. Yeah. This thing is <laughs> massive. 
Oh my god, okay. Um, oh my god, this is very comfortable though. Okay, so we've got it put together pretty much. I've got to get this other stuff out of this room because it's just like, it looks crazy. It looks really crazy in here. Oh my god, this is like really, really big. I think I might have to. Maybe we can't, maybe you can't walk by this way. I mean, it is one of those. Oh, I'm just like in shock. This thing is just so cute. Like, it just looks so good. Okay. Ooh, I might have to turn the rug the other way. Because I need, yeah, I might have to turn this rug the other way. Which is fine. Okay. I love this. I just need to fix the rug situation. I'm just going to flip it, and I think that'll look really good. Um, I already measured it yesterday, and the couch, like this back side of the couch, is wider than the rug is long. Hopefully, I measured it right. I just talked and didn't have the camera going. <laughs> anyway, I was saying I hate how I could see where the rug is, so I want to put that up under the couch a little bit. But overall, it looks pretty darn good. ottoman out i might change out the candle because i think it would look better maybe if there was like a little skinnier candle and then two of these have broken so i need to get some more coasters oh my gosh it's coming together wow okay so my number one concern was like being able to walk through this area but there's definitely three feet here so it should be great and then i was also concerned about being able to walk over here and this looks good as well. I'll probably move the basket somewhere else. And then I'll probably move that plant somewhere else too. This is so exciting. Okay, this is so great. Now I have to clean up all this crap. But I'm definitely going to show when I get the um, pillowcases and pillows from Amazon. Which should be any minute now. And I'll show you guys that. But this looks so good. It just looks so luxurious. Like... It just elevates this room so much. Like, I spend so much time in this room because I work from home and I normally work in here so I can sit with the dogs all day. And, you know, of course, we, we hang out here and watch movies and it's just going to be so nice. Like, this is just so cozy and comfy and so many people can just enjoy this. And it's just... are so cute too. This is what the other ones look like. Yay! And we can chop them. So here is the couch all put together. I still, I'm gonna get um, like a blue throw blanket to maybe put there or maybe on the side somewhere, something like that. But it's so cute. I just love, 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 love how it turned out. Just looks so nice and comfortable in here. And yeah, I love it. I'm gonna end the video here. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching me struggle through putting this sectional together. It was actually really fun and it was a good experience. Um, yeah, I love how 
the couch turned out. I just can't wait to spend so much time in here getting cozy and watching movies. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye.